Balmer Peak, maybe I'll actually have a, a, an amazing run because I'm just, I don't give a shit. I doubt that'll happen. It feels like my controller's like breaking. Quantum, thank you for the resub. Six months in a row. What a baller you are. Let's open this beer. Oh boy. Uh, good for Tim Tebow. <laughs> And I wish he was in the AFC East and not on the Bills so that we could beat him. In fact, I have no idea who we're playing this year, to be honest with you. Really? Are you serious? Dude, these 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 things are getting worse and worse. These uh beginnings of runs, if you will. I guess you could call it series station is what it's called. Oh man, I hate it when I have a coaster and the can that I put the coaster on is wet. The can that I put on the coaster. I'm going to speak in a loud, obnoxious voice so that I sound like I'm casting, but I'm really not. How is everybody doing tonight? I hope you're doing well. I doubt anybody is joining me from the Dota 2 Canada Cup stream, despite some people being like, Wow, Super Metroid is really interesting. I really like that. And I'm like, hmm, you know, you should come watch me stream sometime. And everyone's like, eh. And I'm like, yeah, you're probably right. This is very self-deprecating. I need to stop. I'm actually so awesome at this game. Let me put it this way. In the amount of downtime we had during the Dota 2 Canada Cup, which was very minimal, I was able to beat this game. That's right. Not a good start to this run, though. I do not play Fusion, no. I... At some point, I will pick up Zero Mission and Fusion. That point is not today. Maybe it is today, who knows. I also need to get new headphones. I have new... I have the Sennheiser, Sennheiser ones that I really should be using. Because these ones are super annoying. If this run fails, I'm going to go get those Sennheiser headphones. Because they're... This is just really annoying. Like, there's a ringing in my right ear. Eesh. I'm so good. Five seconds. Watch that slip away over the next couple of moments. Just kidding. I'm actually so good. Gotta learn how to ledge grab, though. That's one thing I do definitely need to learn. So far, so good. God, I need to tweet about this run. But I have no time. Maybe on the elevator I'll tweet about it. Maybe I'll have time then. Ooh, that was the sickest mock ball I've ever made in my life. It was so smooth. I'm hitting it. Let's go. Well, it could be worse. That's too bad, Noah. Hello? 
headphones, man. That is not the way I usually go through that room, and I need to figure out this route better. I somehow only lost like, actually, I lost like five seconds. I speed run a game called Prince of Persia 2, The Shadow and the Flame. I might play that tonight if I'm still feeling good. Right now I'm feeling pretty good though. So. I guess we have to hope that this controller holds up, because right now I feel like it's about to break. Prince of Persia is probably next if I PB this or if I get bored of this. If you're willing to stick around. It's up to you, though. I'm going to try to commentate this and make this as interesting as possible, but no guarantees. Oh, no, that's not good. Oh, that's also not good. Uh, whatever, I guess it worked out. Yeah, it is. It's on, it's on a legal emulator of SNES 9X 1.53. There are two illegal emulators, which is SNES 9X 1.42 and ZSNES any version, because they do not emulate lag properly. So, for example, when you get to Norfair, Lower Norfair, on a regular Super Nintendo, it will lag the game. Uh, it does that in this version, but not in the ZSNES version. So, here's the first trick of the game, and I hit it. It's called a mock ball. And we are now getting super missiles early, which is nice. It's a little cute thing. I can never get past that freaking guy. So... Good stuff. Let's see if I can hit this turn. Nope. I don't know how to do that. Like if you if you're in the turning animation and you hit a drop block, you go for, you go faster through it. But I have no idea how to hit it. Now we're gonna try another mock ball here called the golden mock ball. We'll see if we hit it. Hit it. Nice. See how I'm like, I went so fast there? It's because I took all the momentum from my jump and I transferred it into my morph, morph ball. So it actually turns into a pretty speedy group. I shouldn't have gotten hit there. That actually did a shit ton of damage to me. That's really bad. God damn it. That's not good. It's actually really, really bad because I'm at 69 HP, which is, I mean, it's hot, but. It's not really what I want right now. And I missed that mm, softball. Softballs are when you drop to the ground and you morph as you drop and you don't bounce, but you don't maintain momentum like you would in a mock ball. At some point, I want my entire, like, regular viewers to be well rehearsed in the art of Super Metroid speedrunning tactics. At some point, that needs to be a thing. So now I have to play a bit more carefully here. And actually, that does help out a lot. For five points, who can tell me why I arm pump with Samus? Five points. Five mop points that will be used for currency later on down the road. 
Like, for example, when I get a bot that gives me currency so that I can use it as, uh, like, for people who want to play dead with me. Why do I, why do I arm pump? Oh, shit! That's unfortunate. Not the worst thing. Ever. Anybody. Anybody at all. Thank you, Satan. You get five points, my friend. I'm gonna make a bot in that way. It'll keep track at some time. I have to ask Dakota about making a bot. He's like, oh, if you want me to go through it one day, I'll totally help you. And I'm like, yeah, okay, man. And then I just like, never asked him. TV streams. You'll get one point for an another correct answer. So, I might die here. Let's see. Oh, I'm alright. Modbot? What's Modbot? Wow, hit me twice. That never happens. I just want a bot that has variables, man. I also want to really kill Kraid. That'd be nice. It'd be nice to kill Kraid. Quickly. Mm, sure. This. Good start. Good run. Good run. What'd you guys think of the games tonight, if anybody was watching? I think, uh... Oh, shit. I think, um... Oops. oops. I think E-Hug should have won that game, probably. They played so bad, though. Maybe not. Uh, maybe I'm just an E-Hug fanboy. I like Pandago a lot. He's a good friend of mine. This this D pad is destroyed. I destroyed this D pad. Oh, my friend doesn't get angry. I'm borrowing this from your friend. Tencent, what's up, man? Good to see you again. Hello, everybody. Thank you for joining me. Very excited. This next month is going to be a pretty cool time for me. I cannot wait to go to the summit. We have... Trough and I are doing something else as well that we can't talk about yet. But uh, we're very excited for it. Mott Packs. Good to see you again, buddy. I didn't see you tonight, though. Okay, hello. Yes, I'm using an uh, SNS controller MC. I do not know the 100% run. I tried learning it, I'm just like, mm, maybe another time. a traitor. It's an interesting way of calling him. <sighs> yeah, 
Yeah, I saw he joined a crew and it was like, Nico did nothing wrong or something. Which is an arguable point. Nico wasn't the worst person in the world, but he wasn't the best protagonist. The Motley crew is very ex exclusive. It's a very exclusive crew. But if you want to be a part of it, let me know. Because I'll definitely add you. And yes, I have already said congrats, Mod Packs, but congrats again, because whatever. I got scared he was going to shoot stuff at me, but he never did. Okay, that worked out. The Coddle Gays, they're pretty good. Dakota actually plays with his viewers, unlike me. I only play with my friends, really. Which is kind of how I, it works with Dota. I don't know. But uh, I'll try playing more with my viewers through Dota and through... Oh, GTA. Watch this gold split. Boom. The Motley Crew is actually not called the Motley Crew. It's called something different. It's called the Cuck Boys, which is an inside joke that no one can get. Please give me one more super and full health. Yeah, that's fine. Oh, no, I didn't do it right. I could have got the freaking uh, speed boost or damage boost, rather. I was so close, though. So much. This room sucks. Oh, I freaking fell. Luckily, I didn't take that much damage. It's a pretty fast run right now. Like, this run is actually pretty good. Which is very surprising because I've had like four drinks, maybe? Four beers? That. Oh, this isn't going to be good. Oh, actually, it worked out. Oh, no. I fucked up. No, you bastard. Where does Greg go to school? Uh, will you stalk him if I tell you? He goes to school at Northeastern. Or he did. I don't know if like he actually is gonna pass. Yeah, he, he's going to slash go went to school at Northeastern. That's right, Satan. You're a special breed. To be fair, Mont Packs, nobody's really going to. Halifax anytime soon though, are they? Hello? Not to like be- I guess that's kind of offensive, sorry. JR, what's up? Do I have an official fan club? No, I don't. I don't think I deserve one. See, there's that self-deprecating. Tell you, I'm the best at it. I mean, I could tell you how I really feel about Quebec McKay, but I don't think you want that. I'm just kidding. I don't, I don't really have a problem with Quebec. Oh, I didn't get the freaking double tap. That sucks. Ooh, I almost ran into that thing. Along with the Bueno Bunch. Sure. If you say so, man. Nice. I'm at full health before getting to the ship. That's amazing. I mean, I'm kind of jealous of Montreal's hockey team, if that's what you're saying.
This is the best run ever. Or not. That kind of sucks. Thanks, Jalkan. Good to see you again, man. I like your color change in your name, unless that was not something you planned on doing. Let's see if I can hit this. Oh, beautiful. Oh, I didn't believe in myself. I didn't hold the jump button, but that was amazing. That was the sickest thing ever. Oh, man, this is a good run. This is such a good run. It takes a real man to be a Sabres fan, let's be honest. year. That's not gonna work. Maybe it will. Yeah, that didn't work. Oh, no! All of that HP gone. Oh, no. Whatever, I still have a decent job. I'll never let you down until you lose the cup. Then I'll let you down. <laughs> See, you have a good year. You win the President's Trophy. You think you're going to win the game. You're going to win the Stanley Cup. You think you're going to go to the Stanley Cup Finals. Then all of a sudden, somebody comes out of nowhere in the Eastern Conference Finals and destroys you. Like the 2006-2007 Buffalo Sabres that lost to the Ottawa Senators as they lost to the Anaheim Ducks in the Stanley Cup Final, which was such a stupid freaking series. Freaking Ray Emery, man, every time. And Heatley and Alfredson, dumbasses. That was our best team in a long time, I should say. Let's see how this goes. Fantoon. Okay, I did not know that was a pattern that you could do, but now I do. At least that was the fastest pattern he could do, so that's really good. I wish I had hit him in the eye there. He's giving me a lot of HP, too, so I'm pretty happy with that. I can be kind of aggressive. So I have to hit him five times every time. Um, right, but he started off on the left side, so it's really weird. I don't know where he's going to be ending up here, to be honest with you. I, I think he should be... No, whatever. Oh no! All right, good. We got five in there. Nice. That was close. That was a lot closer than it should be. All right, same pattern probably. He's probably gonna open the same spot. But I don't know if I can hit him in the eye. I'm taking a lot of damage with that really should take. That's so hard to do. So that was a shit pattern. Hopefully he switches patterns next time. I think he does. Where are you? Ooh, that did more damage than I wanted it to. Same exact pattern. No, fast pattern. If I, I can kill him here. Please go up. Two. Three, four. No, oh, I missed! I fucking missed! I fucking missed! 
No. Please do not hit me. Three flames. Oh shit. That could have been the best fight, and it was not the best fight. This boss is so freaking hard, and I hate him. I'd rather fight Dragon and Ridley 5,000 times. Not the worst. It could have been a lot worse, I suppose. Fuck him or he's shit. Well, that's probably why he's not playing anymore, unless he's a backup somewhere that I don't give a shit about. Is he still on the flyers? I mean, I know he went elsewhere. Can you die? Thank you. Well, he would be. I actually don't even hate Emery that much. I hate the rest of their team. That team was so dumb. I'm actually not that vindictive. We weren't good enough that year, I guess. We were too young. Miller what didn't have his best season, which is arguably his silver medal season. Until Sidney Crosby screwed him all up. Uh, and then Mulan Lucic, obviously. Running against him had a pretty big effect on his mental aspect of the game. What am I at here? 710, 751 PB. Mm, I'm going to lose some time here. I really shouldn't, but I'm going to. That sucks. <laughs> What is it? Lightning, um, not pens, because that's the Rangers. Lightning, not Montreal, because that's Ottawa. Lightning, uh, who are they playing? I have no idea. I can't remember. Uh, Lightning who? I can't remember. Who are they playing? Not the Caps, because they're playing the Islanders. No, I mean, I know who the Lightning are. Like, who are they playing? That's right, I forgot Detroit was in the Eastern Conference. They changed that, what, last year? Two years ago, something like that? Listen, I know about hockey, all right? You don't have to... <laughs> I'm a good I'm a good hockey fan. I haven't watched this year because the Sabres were so bad. I was just like, uh, I watched like the first couple of games of the Sabres. I'm like, I'm not subjecting myself to this pain. Which I guess kind of makes me a fair weather fan when you think about it. And I guess it's awful, but... Don't you do the same thing? Detroit does always make the playoffs. I hear Babcock's, Babcock is leaving them, though. That's what I heard. That'd be nice. Because I want the Sabres to get him. Because we have Eichel now. And everyone's like, oh, McDavid, McDavid. I'm just like, well, Eichel's probably just as good a player. He could turn out to be a better player in Buffalo than McDavid does in Edmonton. But I also think that everyone's like, ah, oh, McDavid's going to lose. You know, he's not going to have a good career anymore. And I'm just like, no, it's not true. McDavid's still going to be a beast. I think I'd be very surprised if he wasn't. He might not play. Um, I think that's just bullshit. Honestly, I think he will. I think he's. I think he's. He, 
there's no reason for him to go back to BU. I've heard rumors that he's not really intelligent, so that him going to school is not to, like, you know, go to school, but rather to play hockey. And if he wanted to play hockey, I mean, I guess he could be like, oh, we didn't win the championship this year, and that's fine, because they lost Providence 4-3, but it depends. I, I guess it depends on... I think he's, like, I think the only reason he said, like, or the only reason that he's saying that he, he could go back to school for years is because he's, like, he wasn't sure he was going to get drafted by, but if he knows he's going to get drafted by the Sabres, he's probably going to come to the Sabres. I don't see him not coming to the Sabres. I mean, that's probably just me talking through rose tinted glasses, but... How did the not hero shot work? Oh, I hit it. There we go. All right. Let's get this next super tank. Yeah, I mean, Edmonton is just a... It's a problem, man. Truly. Fucking four of the last six years. Unbelievable. Not that any of those players are bad right now. Like, they're all pretty good. You know? It's just that they don't have a good team. Anyways. Hockey can be dumb. No doubt there. Right, Kevin Lowe should not be a GM, like, ever again. He's been GM since, like, 2006, 2007. I mean, heck, we got rid of Darcy Regeer just a little while ago. Like, two years ago? And he was with us since 1999. Anyways, again, enough. This boss actually sucks for me. I hate him. I have a lot of supers, though, so let's hope he goes well. Okay. How does that miss? There we go. What? What's some trouble? I need to be over here. boss is so annoying. I actually hate him. I don't even need to get all that. I should have just... I should not have picked that up. That was a waste of time. Because I'm going to get an E-Tank right here anyway. So close again. 
I can never get that during a run, but I get it during practice all the time. Stop hitting me. What? Fuck you. a little time here. No, I think I'll be even or ahead. The question is whether I want to go for that extra energy tank in Norfair. Really get ballsy. Galgo. Pretty good Meridia, in all honesty. Ooh, that's pretty good. That usually doesn't happen.
good thing I didn't go through that door. No! That's fine. Beam. I just like the movement. I think it looks really cool and it feels good. I I don't really know why I like it so much, but I do. It's just the way it is, I suppose. There's no reason for me to like it. I've never really played the game. Like, I didn't really play the game as a kid. It just feels like fun to play. Like Even after playing it over and over and over again, it's just fun to see what I can do, you know? I don't know how else to describe it. Why do people keep playing Dota? Because they like to see what they can accomplish in, like, a vacuum. You know what I mean? If you have decent players on your team, and, like, you pick the hero you want to play, there's a good chance you're going to do something cool with it. Or at least something you consider cool. That's, I don't know, that's a dumb reason why, but that's what I think anyways. Match it with four E tanks. Don't screw me over too hard, please.
maybe I will go for the, uh, the tank I haven't decided yet. Of a bitch.
Woo let's go, baby! Let's go for E Tank Ridley! Yes, let's do it! Oh man, that's sick. That's very sick. Yeesh. Got to split. I got really serious and I stopped talking to him, I guess. I don't know, I didn't really do anything. I just focused on my run. After it got to a point where I was like, oh, this could actually be pretty good. That's when I started.
I'm not doing that. I'm not doing that again. It's just easier to do it that way. Oh, you bastard. It's looking pretty good. As long as I don't get hit by a Metroid, I should be in good shape. I also have to go to the restroom pretty badly, so that's kind of unfortunate, but whatever. Screen transitions, please. Amiga. life to work with, so I need to get the um, Zebatite glitch first try, otherwise I'm screwed. Let's have a good tour in, folks. Then we'll get a PB and kill my brain, hopefully. That's the biggest issue. Really, it's just the Zebatite glitch taking too much damage. I don't know why I'm avoiding that. Good. That was pretty good. Can you want me up? Thank you.
Go, mother brain, you can suck my dick. Woo, baby. <laughs> yeah, what's up, mother brain? You think you've won, dumbass? Fucking idiot. What you got? I got that baby Metroid on fucking lockdown. Let's fucking go. You got shit. She gave me some brain, all right. You know what? You know what you're talking about, Weave. You got him. You got him. Fuck this fucking mother brain. What's up? What's up, baby? How you doing? Hey, give me all that energy back. Let's go. Let's fucking go. Completely out of ammo. I don't need it. I don't fucking need it. I'm gonna fucking destroy you, mother brain. You, you fucking, don't you touch my baby. Don't you touch my baby. Stop it. Fucking stop it. Don't. Don't do it. No! Oh my god. You whore. You're done. You're fucking done! If I could do all the shit right.
This is an anticlimactic. This is the best fucking end of the game ever. Like, this is amazing. This was in 1994. You're gonna tell me this was anticlimactic? Come on, man. Give me that shine spark. Let's fucking go. Fuck off, space pirate idiot. Sub 109, unfortunately. That's all right. Uh, it's gonna be close, actually. I'm not gonna make it. No, it's gonna be 109 ish. What? Get down there. Ugh, all right. Good stuff. Sub 110. Thank you guys for watching me get this PB. Minus 230 is pretty good. It's going to be hard to beat that. There's a couple ways I can, but uh, I don't know if I'm going to keep going. I'm, I'm pretty happy with that. I, I would like to get sub one hour if possible, but it's really tough. There's a lot of things that I have to do. And I think I, uh, I'm pretty happy with that run. I need to like, the gravity suit split, I could save, like, 30 seconds there, but, like, to, to save nine minutes seems very difficult. Like, I do not know how I could possibly save nine, nine minutes. That seems really difficult. It seems really hard. I don't know how people get 43s in this game, let alone sub one hour, so... I'll reverse that, actually. That puts me at 240 or 250th in the all-time leaderboards of Super Metroid. It's a lot of people. 250. That that seems like a lot of people. If I could if somehow I would be able to get like sub 55, I'd be top 100, but that seems very difficult. Uh, to do it the way the world record does it would be almost impossible, in my opinion. I would have to do Fantoon on two E tanks. I would have to skip the moat without having Shine Spark, which is very hard. And even that doesn't really save that much time. Uh, I would have to do Norfair and lower Norfair with two E tanks. Actually, I think three, maybe. Um, and I had enough trouble with Ridley as it was with four. World record is 4304 by a guy named Zost. His Twitch is twitch.tv slash Zosty. Uh, I would have to do... What else would I have to do? 
So technically, the order for the bosses uh, in the world record run, which this sounds ridiculous, is Fantoon first, followed by Ridley, second, followed by Kraid, who's the first boss of the game, he'd be third, followed by Dragon would be fourth. And then, of course, Mother Brain. You would have to do... I think you do... You Well, I mean, you have to have four E-Tanks to do uh, Mother Brain, I think. I mean, it's possible for me to do that, but I just... It would take a lot. I'm pretty happy with the way I did... Uh, with, the, with how I did, though. Like, I really just need to fix, like, general movement and stuff. Like, and, and that would be, that's it. Like, that's all I need to really do is, like, just get better at ledge grabbing and understanding how certain rooms work and what the best way to go through a room is. And that just takes time. And that's why I was, like, going so fast is because, like, I I played, I just played through the game during the Dota 2 Canada Cup uh, breaks, and I, I played through it, and I was just realizing, it was okay, this is the best option here, this is the best option there. So I was warmed up so that when I did get to the part in Lower Norfair, which usually wrecks me, uh, I had a pretty good lower Norfare. In fact, I mean, obviously, I saved a minute. A lot of that minute is from not getting that uh, fourth E-Tank, or the fifth E-Tank, rather, before going to fight Ridley. And I was kind of scared, because I felt like, you know, if I get hit, like, by Mother Brain, like, three times, then I'm gonna, I'm gonna, that's it. Because you have to have three and a half, e you have to have 3.5 E-Tanks to be able to kill Mother Brain. And I was just above that. I was at 3.75. So I thought that was good. And then, of course, I screwed up a little bit on the escape. That could have been better. Not that that's that big of a deal. I could have done a lot better here on Space Jump um, on the Dragon fight. And honestly, like, Fantoon could be, like, a minute faster if I just knew how to actually, like, if I knew his patterns and I knew uh, how to X-Factor, Fantoon could easily be a minute and a half faster. So Kraid is about as fast as it can get with a quick kill. Um, Ridley is about as fast as it can get for me. Um, Dragon, I could get a little bit faster. And Fantoon, I can get a little bit faster. Botswoon, I can get a lot faster because I hate that boss. But anyways, I'm going to take a, a quick break. I'm going to go to the bathroom and I'll be back. I don't know what I'm going to do next. I have honestly no idea. So I'll see you in a second. <laughs> 